hey y'all christy from homes and things listen this is a beautiful home we're getting ready to tour the name of the home is staying alive it's a three bedroom two bath home it's 1474 square feet it has a built-in front porch it comes in a variety of colors and i'm just super super excited to show it to you it's out here at oakwood homes in lexington south carolina and i actually toured this home some time ago so it's about time i bring it to you now go ahead and take a look at the specs and the exterior of the home and we'll get right into the tour. <music> Alright, so now that we've had a chance to look at the exterior of the home, take a look at this porch. It's a built-in porch and of course you can add additional porch to it, but I thought it was a nice feature. Now as you enter the home, you enter into the living room. And this living room has some nice big windows. You have three big windows in this room. Uh, it's a comfortable space where you can put your living room furniture here and you have a look into the kitchen and dining room from the home so really nice touch i like the fact that this space is open but then you have a separation of rooms so that's something to think about when you're viewing this home and thinking how your family um would appreciate the layout of this home again this is the living room area and now we'll take a spin around and see the kitchen and off to the right you have your dining room so the first room we'll enter is, is the dining room and you have another set of big windows in here three windows in here this is a nice space for to give you like a separate formal type dining room as you can see you have a partial wall that separates you from the dining room and the kitchen so you can still see into the dining room from the living room or the kitchen when you're entertaining but it also gives it a measure of privacy i could see having a maybe a dinner party in this room and you can leave and bring dishes from the kitchen but not have it open into the kitchen so really nice now this is your kitchen area, another nice space. I love the fact that it has a dark uh, island, but it has the exterior cabinets are a lighter color, so really nice. Love the color of the countertops. You have stainless steel appliances in here, which is always a plus. And you have uh, a nice stainless steel uh, uh, hood over the kitchen, so really lovely. This is your uh, refrigerator here, lots of pantry space around the refrigerator, lots of cabinet space in this room. Just a really nice workspace to provide meals for your family. So really, really nice. I love the fact that you have this window here that can open, bring in ventilation. You have another area right here where you can uh, either leave open or if you want to put a little small a uh, table for maybe an eat-in kitchen that would be lovely as well next to your back door you have your laundry room now the laundry room is open but you do have space in here as you can see for a built-in refrigerator or freezer that goes in there in addition to your washer and dryer so really nice All right, right off the kitchen, you have your additional bedroom number one. Now this bedroom is carpeted. It's a nice size bedroom. The specs, if I have them, will be on the screen. You have a standard uh, closet in this room. Really nice space for an additional bedroom. 
One of the things that I appreciate too, when you come to view the homes, you can almost imagine what your furniture would look like in the room, how you would decorate the home, which family member would belong or mesh well in what room. So think about that as you tour these homes on video as well. See yourself inside the home. It really makes a big difference as to how you view the home. Every home isn't always going to have every single thing you want, but you can always upgrade or really make the house what you want it to be. Okay, so the next room we come to is the additional bathroom. Average size bathroom, you've got everything you need in here. It is a bit cozy, but everybody doesn't need a large uh, secondary bathroom. So really nice. You've got uh, storage space, you've got your built-in tub and shower combo. Really nice uh, bathtub in here. So another feature that I like about this bathroom is that it, there's can lighting in this room as well so it's nice and bright in here for makeup or whatever you need it for next you have your secondary bedroom number two now this additional bedroom another nice space also has carpet in it uh, not quite the size of the first additional bedroom but you have room to work with Another standard closet in this bedroom. Overall, a nice space. I absolutely love it. One thing that I didn't point out about this house is it does have finished drywall. So you don't have those panels like you do in some manufactured homes. This home has uh, finished drywall in it. So really a nice touch. Love the fact that all the bedrooms are on one side. Really reminds you more of the stick built home love the features last but not least you have your master bedroom at the end of the hallway now this home is it furnished you may not be able to tell just how much space you have in here i don't think the camera does it justice really decent sized bedroom you could put a king size bed in this room love it you've got two big windows bringing in lots of natural light it's nice and bright in here uh, you've got a closet and you've got uh, your master over here first things first we'll take a look at the master closet which is separate from the master bathroom or primary bathroom which is always nice so the only thing that this home this particular home doesn't have is they didn't bring the um railing all the way around this home would probably not leave the lot and be delivered to me until they put more um hanging uh the hanging uh racks in this closet so i would bring it all the way around just to get maximize the space in there or if you're thinking about um adding a different type of uh closet feature in there that's something to think about it'd be less to have to pull down but if you're going to take it as is i would get some more of the uh hanging racks to hang in there now this is your primary bathroom i always love these big rectangular sinks it gives you lots of uh, sink space i uh, love the rustic features around the mirrors really nice uh light bright bathroom love the flooring and the cabinet color together really really pretty you have a window that opens so you have ventilation in here love the fact that this this double shower has a place to sit or put your feet when you're taking a shower really really lovely again it's a nice size shower love it love all the space to put your personal hygiene items when you are in the shower it's a beautiful bright white color absolutely love it i replaced that shower head with a rain shower shower head just a big shower head or maybe even one that also has a handheld really lovely and then you have your commode uh, behind the shower or next to the shower really pretty really really pretty so really nice uh primary 
bathroom you have this additional space behind the door you could do what you like you want to put a hamper there or a bench there or some additional storage shelving it's really up to you but it's a nice uh, additional space that you can maximize in your bathroom so really nice so that's it for the primary bedroom you guys will go take a look at the price of the home hope you've enjoyed this tour again the name of this home is staying alive it's a three bedroom two bath home it's 1474 square feet this home is at oakwood homes in lexington south carolina the starting price of this home is 112,000, but with delivery and setup it's 1357. So if you're interested in this home, call Oakwood Homes in Lexington, South Carolina. The information is in the description.